Alright. I am back. Um, can't tell if I need to use the restroom or not, so if I randomly pause for an ex extended period of time, it's because I'm in the restroom. Now that's a lot of that's TMI, but it is what it is, honestly. Uh, so I need to exploring other places too. That, that place for sure. How do I get here? Um, yeah, and that work on this part, so uh, wish me luck. Here we go. We depart within the hour. Where are you headed? Safe travels to you. State your destiny. Tell me. We can find room, depending on your... Tell me. We depart within the hour. Where are you? Safe travels to you.
The guild has need of you, comrade. Always a pleasure, Thar. I Find see my summons reached you. Good. Good. You may wonder who I am and why I sent for you. Don't. Just trust me. I have only the best interests of the Empire in mind, but we must leave now if we're going to take advantage of the situation. A situation that could end the Three Banners War and get Irene, Emmerich and Joran to return to their senses. While these children squabble over territory, the common people and the Empire suffer. We have an opportunity and we need to jump on it. In simple terms, I just purchased two halves of an ancient tablet, the Wrathstone. It forms a map that should lead us to a weapon whose existence will force all sides to cease their aggressive behavior. Help me acquire this weapon and end the war. We must hurry. Even now, someone follows me, resisting my best efforts to identify them. While I deal with this threat, I need you to begin the process of locating the triangulants. Without them, the map is worthless. Of course it is. I just invented it. Right now, the map shown on the Wrathstone has no identifying features. Without the triangulants, I have no context by which to read the map. I know a Khajiiti lawmaster, however, who can help with that. Each half of the tablet contains part of a map and an inscription. Kanzari and the demon weapon. The key to finding the triangulants resides in that Khajiiti myth. We must convince Dagaril Dro to direct us to storytellers who know the legend. Dagaril Dro often relaxes in stone falls. We need to bring him a gift, however, and I happen to know he is fond of dusk mushrooms. Gather the mushrooms in High Tide Hollow, then meet me at the Lawmaster's camp. I'll mark the location on your map. I know about a great many things, but Khajiiti legends tend to be convoluted. The Lawmaster must direct us to the secret order of storytellers, the Moon Singers. Only they can set us on the correct path. Now, gather the mushrooms for Dagar Ildro. in this fight. It's not safe here.
spiders. Damn the gods, why is it always spiders? Ah, oh, oh, you're not who I thought you were. I'd clear out, stranger. Spiders in this cave. Lots and lots of spiders. I'll live. One of the spiders got a piece of me, and the venom's doing some strange... Wow, my blood tastes really green right now. Anyway, we had reports of goblins attacking the locals out here. They normally live in this filthy hole. Only dead ones. It's strange. The little bastards normally have their bugs on a short leash. Something's happened to them. I probably shouldn't go back in there. Will you look around inside? Find what I couldn't? Uh, good. Good. I think I'll have a sit down out here. The wind seems very gooey, doesn't it? Very squishy. Uh, oh yes, yes. Uh, I, I think so. Is it normal for your guts to move when you're standing still? Or your eyeballs to crawl up inside your head? Right, I'm fine. Fine.
You're back. Sorry about earlier. I'm feeling better already. What news from the spider hole? Those crafty bastards. Use the beastmen's own bugs to drive them out of the caves. Then the beasties raise havoc with the civilians. Crafted milk-drinking sots they are. Good work. I'll be sure the General sees this. Oh! <laughs> 
Walker, good tidings and heartfelt salutations. The Garildro wonders what brings you to this serene location. This one rarely receives visitors. Wait, wait. Uh, something smells delicious, yes? <laughs> Do you uh, perhaps carry dusk mushrooms in your bag? Dusk mushrooms? For Dagaril Dro? What a kind and generous gift to present to this old bag of fur and bones. <laughs> Still, even a gift is rarely free. Speak, and this one will listen. Maybe even help if it is within this one's ability to do so. Does he now? What else has that old wizard told you? And why does an ancient battle mage care about a secret order of storytellers and a forgotten hero named Kunzari? No matter. For Dusk Mushrooms, this one will tell you almost anything. <laughs> oh, these will make wonderful soup. <laughs> Thank you. Three moon singers carried the secret tale of Kunzari and the demon, each a different part. Find a Zargo Longtail at the Red Fur Trading Post, Miss Bina at Bandari Trading Post, and Satari in Raurka. I see you made it to the old Lawmaster's camp. Were the Dusk Mushrooms to his liking? Grotwood, Malabal Tor, and Reaper's March. Not an easy journey, but I can make it more tolerable. Allow me to open a portal to Redfur Trading Post. Track down the first Moonsinger and hear the beginning of Kunzari's tale. I'll be along shortly. I'll catch up with you after I pay my respects to you. Search my packs, you will find nothing! This one is innocent! Tell her, Gomani! and a helping hand. Kunzari said, Not by myself, foul demon. I shall gather a Krajun, a company of heroes. Starting with the Atma, Lurarian the Perfect, who communes among the buried roots of the alien worms. These are the words, and the words are true. This one recognizes a lover of stories when he sees one. Care to hear another tale? Old grandfather sent you. Interesting. This one can only tell you what he knows, and Azargo only knows the beginning of the story. That is the way of things concerning the great stories and the secrets they hold. Are you sure you want to hear it? In the time before time, when the Sixteen Kingdoms were barely more than Sixteen Tribes, the great hero Kunzari went on many adventures. After Kunzari defeated the giant troll by consuming 401 moon sugar pies, he met a demon. No, oh, a different kind of demon. Now be quiet and listen. The demon said, my brothers and I shall take this land and its treasures, even the moons from the sky. Kunzari objected, but the demon laughed. You cannot stop us, little cat thing. Kunzari said, not by myself, foul demon. I shall gather a Krajun, a company of heroes, starting with the Altmer, Nurarian the Perfect, who communes among the buried roots of the alien worms. These are the words. And the words are true. What an interesting story. If only I could shake my shadow as easily as Kunzari does, well, anything. At least now I know where to find the first triangle. 
Yes, the triangulant. The first reference point that will allow us to use the map and locate the weapon. We must proceed with caution, however. My unknown follower utilizes a magic I cannot penetrate. I need to conserve my energy, just in case. The location was spelled out in the Moonsinger's story. The verse concerning Nureri and the Perfect. It's as clear as the sky on a cloudless day. Among the buried roots of the Aeliad worms. It refers to a place I know well. Worm root depths. An Aeliad ruin located here in Grotwood. Somewhere in worm root depths, the ancient Khajiit hid a reference point that will get us one step closer to finding the weapon. We should travel separately, for safety's sake. I'll meet you inside the ruin. Ah, the distinctive smell of Daedric sorcery. It's as atrocious as it is pervasive. Seems adequate, if a bit unrefined. Come <laughs> on. 
If I wasn't preserving my power, we'd be done. The distinctive smell of Daedric sorcery. It's as atrocious as it is pervasive. I'm not sure what I expected, but it certainly wasn't this. The ancient Khajiiti really want us to work to uncover the triangle. Hmm. Examine the moons on each statue. Pretty ingenious for a bunch of ancient cats. Why don't you see what's in the chest? Come along. I can't maintain this portal indefinitely. Are reset because two shall become three annoying the demon. As soon as this one rescues Flynn demon hunter from the alien lair of creeping air plants. These are the words, and the words are true. 
Miss Bina hopes that you and your friend enjoyed this story. Is there anything else that this one can do for you? The Lore Master? Ah, this one hasn't talked to him in a long time. Miss Bina only knows the second part of the story. That is how the Moon Singers maintain the secrets of the Great Tales. Would you like to hear the story again? In the time before time, when the Sixteen Kingdoms were young and like kittens at play, the great hero Kunzari gathered the company of champions to combat the demon and his brothers. They had come to elsewhere to steal the moons from the sky. Ominous, oh, indeed. With Nurarian already at his side, Kunzari turned his attention to the next champion he planned to recruit. The power of the moons will be ours, little cat thing, taunted the demon. How can two possibly hope to stop many? Kunzari said, because two shall become free, annoying demon. As soon as this one rescues Flintville Demon Hunter from the alien lair of creeping ebony plants. These are the words, and the words are true. You know, the legend of Kunzari is more interesting than I remember. It must be Moon Singer Ms. Bina's delivery. Marginally entertaining. She made the location of the next triangulant quite clear to one of exceptional intellect, such as myself. Of course, only the nearby Black Vine ruins could be referred to as the alien lair of creeping ebony plants. I never cared for carnivorous vegetation. I'll meet you in the ruins after I make one more attempt to catch my elusive stalker. Yes, and with brazen impunity. I almost caught my stalker here at the trading post before they slipped away in the crowd. They're like an insect buzzing around my head that I can't quite swat. Someone with that level of power concerns me greatly.
speed. I've seen dozing Argonians move faster than that. The price you're Don't asking want to is pay? outrageous. That's fine. I'm sure I can find someone who'll meet my price over in Skyward.
I sense light. I sense life, Magica. I sense life. Five fold then. Alright, that'll be it for today. Um, hopefully I remember where that quest is. If not, I'll just do some other stuff, but yeah, that's what a lot of this is for me, is I don't remember where I was, you know, and 
There's so many other side quests I can do. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. Otherwise, peace out.